Hey guys, what's in this video? I'm gonna do a quick little and to do benchmark of the new Android L that I uh, installed on my Nexus 5. So I'll be checking out the to do benchmark. Previously, I was getting very low score uh, on the 4.4.4 KitKat, so let's check it out. We'll be doing a full test. And we'll wait. This is the Android L, as you can see the new touch buttons here square, circle, and triangle, PlayStation buttons. So, if you now know how to install the Android L, just read the link in the description. I have a full tutorial and also my full review about the Android L is also is in the description, link in the description. So, So it does take some time, but you know, Untodo Benchmark is one of the best benchmark apps uh, that are available for Android, and you know, they test out 3D and CPU performance and everything, so no problem. So currently the top uh, device that is leading the N22 benchmark is Samsung Galaxy S5 Octa-Core. Uh, this device has the highest score ever, 36,000 something, beating out even the Snapdragon 8201 variant, which is awesome. So we are almost there, 70 percent. Yeah, it's checking some 3D performances. So most of the apps are not working good on the Android L beta. They will be working very soon when they release a stable, uh, stable build. So let's see what frame rate we are getting here. We are getting the FPS 35, 28, 29, 39, 40, 37. FPS maximum is 40, 29 to 40 FPS in this 3D task. So almost done. Oops, as you can see, unfortunately, N22 benchmark has stopped. So this is the another reason why the Android beta is not, uh, you know, not compatible with the apps and yes if you just want to use messaging and all those kind of stuff you can use it but still as you can see I have run the full benchmark tab but still I cannot see my score on the Android beta version uh, because the app and the beta version is not optimized for it so uh, yes thanks for watching guys it's a quick look compatibility test of the Intuitu benchmark app and I will see you in the next video peace